What's going on guys? Wax Cracker coming at you with another break. And for all my baseball fans out there, happy official opening week. And in recognition of that, I'm going to go ahead and open up this box of 2013 Tribute. Topps Tribute, World Baseball Classic. This is your typical Topps Tribute format, but with the uh, 2013 World Baseball Classic in mind. So, super cool looking stuff. I got lucky, lucked out on a bid on eBay, got this for like half of what you would normally find these for. So, I'm going to get cracking into it. Six packs in a box. There's going to be a hit in every pack. Super shiny stuff. I love shiny stuff, so I'm excited about this. Um, I have opened Tribute products before, but this is my first from um, this particular year and uh, theme. And um, yeah, it's up. I, I just got luck. I just lucked out. I, there was a good bid, good low bid on it. I put it in for like a dollar over and apparently nobody cared and I ended up with it. So here we go. I can't remember if it's uh, three autos and three relics or two autos and three relics, but there we go. Thicker packs, the cards do have thicker stock. There we go. Right, pack number one. Like I said, super shiny stuff. All the cards have this refractor type of look to them. So, Tribute never disappoints. I know I have a lot of uh, football fans on my channel. Tops Tribute made one appearance for football, and that was back in 2010. The same configuration and everything. Um, I don't know why they didn't make a comeback. Base card number two, Angel Pagan. And there's our first hit. Derek Holland, blue auto to 50, Team USA. Nice. Awesome looking stuff. Ryan Vogel song. Tadashi Setsu. Anyway, um, yeah, Topps Tribute made one appearance for football back in 2010. Same configuration and everything. And I'm not really sure why they didn't come back. I know the reviews for it were a little lukewarm. They were criticizing the uh, the price relative to the hit quality. But um, I do have one sealed box back there that I've been holding on to. I've had it for like three years now. And I've opened, I opened one way back in 2010 when it came out. And did really well with it, but um, I just I just don't know. I don't know if I, I if I can open it, but same awesome looking stuff. Jerickson profile. Heath Bell stuff so shiny I can't even really read it. Got another auto. Oh, that's Drew Cabrera. Remember him with the uh, with the Indians? Is that numbered? Not numbered. Cool. Jonathan LaCroix. Atsushi Nomi. Alright. This one feels fatter. This might be a relic or a patch. I've seen some crazy looking patches come out of this stuff over the years. Yeah, definitely a patch or an RPA. Or a, not necessarily an RPA. A patch or a patch auto in here. Carlos Gonzalez. And it's a patch. A little bit of a, a break there. Hung Wen Chen to 119. Little bit of white there on the left side. Yadier Molina. Craig Kimbrell. Alright, another fat one here. Tribute is always fun. Problem is, huh? maybe it's not a fat one. Problem is, it's always super expensive. This stuff got super cheap for a while. It was like released at 300 bucks. I remember when I was living in Buffalo. I was living in Buffalo when it came out, and the stuff was down to like 100 bucks a box. Yadier Pedroso, Sergio Romo, 
Oh, auto. Anthony Rizzo, nice. That's an awesome auto, actually. Playing for my Cubbies these days. Representing Team Italy. Very nice. Adrian Gonzalez. James Italian. Um, you can find this about average, what I've seen, uh, about 165 these days. It's gone up a little bit because it's gotten a little more scarce. But as far as Topps Tribute products go, it's about as cheap as you can hope for. This might be another auto in here. Edwin Encarnacion. Toshia Siguchi. Yeah, it is another one. A short print, 2 to 25. Jason Grilly. Another Team Middle East auto. That gold looks nice. Felipe Amant. Dai Kang Yang. All right, last pack here. This one is probably going to be another relic. Yeah, definitely got a fat one in there. Super fat, actually. John Axford. Hanley Ramirez. Look at that. That's a nice looking patch there. Three color break. Out of five. Two of five. Eric Hosmer. Nice. I typically have terrible luck with Topps products, but that's a nice super short print there. I believe that's a black. Number two of five. That's awesome. And Marcos Gudero. All right, guys. Thanks for tuning in. And as always, get cracking.